Well, hello. I hope you're doing well as you have just begun your journey through Math 100, Liberal Arts Mathematics. Here, uh, today, I just want to tell you how to get started on your homework. Okay, your homework assignments. I just want to make sure you know exactly what to do and where to look for your exercises. All right, let me share my screen with you. Okay, so when you go into your Canvas shell, this is probably what you're seeing. Uh, you may just click on the modules because that's where you will be spending most of your time uh, in for this class. All right, so click on the modules and um, <clears throat> pretty soon this may be your front page of your Math 100 Canvas shell. Uh, anyway, so when you see the modules here, you know, you see the first module, Welcome to Math 100. The second module, of course, is Chapter 1. And uh, Chapter 1, Section 1.2 is the first uh, chapter or section that you will be studying or you have been studying, maybe. Uh, click on uh, Section 1.2, and this is what you will see. As I instructed in the uh, introductory video, you are to create or to uh, produce, uh, print out your PDF file. This is where you take your notes. You watch your uh, part one and part two of the videos uh, we have. And then you have an optional PowerPoint slides, which you could look at if you like. And then uh, your homework, ex well, you know, so you do your online quiz here. Once you do your paper, uh, version of the quiz, which is the last page of the PDF file. And then your exercises are here, okay? This is the set of homework exercises you are to do for uh, section 1.2. You do not have to do all the exercises uh, in this section in the textbook. These are the only ones. Typically, you have between four and 10 exercises to do for each section. Now, it's on page 32. And by the way, it's always highlighted right in the middle of the page, so you can't miss it, okay? And uh, so these are the, the problems. Now, where are you going to look for these exercises? Many of you have already found these exercises. Some, you some of you have not, all right? So the where do you find your textbook, okay? Let's go back to the modules. And in the very beginning on the first welcome module, I have this third item, which is the uh, textbook download page, let's click on that and see what happens, okay? Well, uh, this is the link to download your book. And um, I have already encouraged all of you to download this entire book, which is 529 pages. Um, I spend a lot of time compiling and writing many parts of this book, so you really should download this, okay? And uh, by the way, to go to page 32, you don't have to code, you know, sort of like randomly trying to find, you know, where's page 32. Uh, you don't have to do that because over here, and this is very helpful. If you didn't know this, uh, you definitely should know how to do this. Uh, when you click on this icon here, it'll just give you liberal arts mathematics. This is the title of the book, but you see this little thing here, click on that and it'll give you the uh, content. We are in chapter one, so click on this arrow, right arrow for chapter one, and the subheadings will appear. Uh, what am I looking for? 1.2, so click on that. And then the sub subheadings will appear and exercises 1.2 is found right here. So you click on that and boom, um, this is page 32. At the bottom of that page, you will see the beginning of the exercises at 1.2. And so these are the problems you do. You don't have to do all the problems. Remember, only five problems are assigned from the section. So that's where you would find these exercises. And it's the same for all the other uh, sections. 1.3, if you click on 1.3, the last thing you see is exercises 1.3. Okay, so this is exactly how you get started on your homework. And as you do your homework, okay, make sure you show your work where necessary, where the uh, answers are not obvious. Try to write exactly your thought processes so that you will have a record of your critical thinking. Okay, that's what I really am looking for when I look for your exercises. Okay, so uh, let me stop the sharing and then uh, we will get back. 
All right. Uh, some of you have um, expressed that you are sort of anxious or scared about the math class. Uh, please reach out to me. I have uh, regular office hours. And uh, in addition to those office hours, I can always be reached by email. Um, if you want to set up a Zoom appointment, uh, individual appointment at the time when it's convenient for you, I am available. All right, so I'm here to help you. So please, please uh, try to reach out whenever you need uh, extra help. All right, I hope you have a great week and I'll see you later. Bye.